Hi, I'm Björn Stolz from Martin Professional. Welcome to this P3 quick tip video on how to map on a background image. So to import a background image, I'll click on project options, choose my image, choose a drawing, scale the image because I know a video skeptron is 1000 millimeters long. So I select that, click in one hand, hold control, release the other hand, click OK. So I have my setup in here. So I will start with making the horizontal lines of video drones. So I have them here. I click R to rotate 90 degrees to lay them out flat and then lay out my line of video drones here. See as they attach end to end as well. Here I'm filling my drawing with eight of them. I can then Take this line, Control C, Control V, copy and paste out a new line, lay them out down here, we move this line up a little bit, then we shall have video flatrons, we should take in here, use shortcut Shift R to lay them out in 45 degrees, shortcut R to have the other one uh, rotate in 90 degrees. Hit escape to deselect, take these two, Control C, Control V, copy, and then take all of them, Control C, V, to do the other ones, put them out like that, then take a single Skeptron, Control C and V, to lay it out flat, Shift R to make it stand up, over here, Control C and V again to copy it. And now add a video doctrine to the top. Then take my whole columns, Control C and V, and keep going. Until I am almost done with these ones. Let me move them up a little bit. This one here, then I've got Mac Allure profiles hanging in the rig here. So I find them here in the library. So I've got these ones here. So I will start by adding these ones manually, like so. Deselect them, take all of them, scale them up a little bit to make them more visible, then add Mac Aura PXLs, which are sitting here, which you can see fills the front lens. And then I'm done with the whole creative video setup in just a few minutes. Thank you for watching this quick tip video.